Welcome to the hot seat and this is another special report. According to a report, Stephen Twitch boss left a suicide note before taking his own life last week in a motel in California that made oblique references to previous struggles he had to overcome. According to law enforcement officials, the adored Ellen DeGeneres show DJ left the note in his Los Angeles motel room, where he had turned his phone to airplane mode to ensure that worried loved ones couldn't locate him. It was unclear exactly to what he was alluding, the outlet claimed, although it appeared to make a vague reference to prior difficulties. According to TMZ, the 40-year-old father of three traveled less than a mile from his $4 million Encino home to the oak tree in motel from his house early on Monday. Allison Holker, a professional dancer who met Boss on So You Think You Can Dance, desperately raced to an LAPD precinct to report his peculiar conduct after being unable to get in touch with him. There were no signs of foul play, according to the Los Angeles County Medical Examiner, and the cause of death was determined to be suicide by gunshot to the head. The investigation was finished. It had just been the ninth wedding anniversary for Boss and Holker. They had three kids together, Zaya, three, Maddox, six, and Wesley, fourteen, who Boss adopted from Holker's previous relationship. In a tragic statement revealing her husband's passing, Holker said, Stephen light up every place he stepped into. He placed the highest priority on his family, friends, and community. He was our family's rock, the best husband and father, and an example to his followers. Stephen Twitch boss mom misses her son in emotional stories post. For Stephen Twitch boss family, friends, and loved ones, the final weeks of 2022 brought sadness when the dancer, choreographer, and DJ committed suicide on December 13th at the age of 40. In the days following his passing, many people who knew him have expressed their condolences, and now his mother has shared an emotional Instagram stories message to express how much she misses her son. The late Stephen Twitch boss's mother, Connie Boss Alexander posted a tribute to her son on Instagram. She posted a statement and a photo to the story, which is no longer active on her account. Look at the article below. The late star's mother posted a picture of a FaceTime conversation with her son along with the hashtag hashtag SLB, which stands for Twitch's full name, Stephen Laurel Boss. Her heartfelt story gave readers a glimpse into her anguish thanks to the use of heart emoticons and her yearning to be able to FT to paradise. Connie Boss Alexander has generally avoided social media in the days since her son passed away, although she did post a message soon after Stephen Twitch Boss passing was made known to the world. Although she couldn't use words right now, she thanked friends and family for all the love, prayers, and encouragement and promised to get in touch later. In order to express how much she misses her late spouse, Allison Holker, who had been married to Stephen Twitch Boss for almost 10 years, recently made her first appearance on social media after his passing. She shared an Instagram post about her one and only. Together, the two had three kids. Stars including former Full House cast member Jody Sween and Derek Hoff, a veteran of Dancing with the Stars. Several people, including Alan Brasseton and Cheryl Burke, left supportive comments for her family in the comment area. It wasn't established that Twitch's suicide was the official cause of death when the news of his passing initially surfaced. Investigators came out to say that the singer had left a message, but the allegation that he'd lost his life savings was incorrect as additional information came to light and stories started to spread. Many famous people released statements in memory of him after his passing, and Tyler Perry was even moved to admit that he had previously attempted suicide. After participating on Fox's So You Think You Can Dance, Twitch got his big break into the spotlight. He later returned to the dance competition series as a judge for the 2022 season. As the DJ for the Ellen DeGeneres show and then as co-executive producer, he would go on to establish himself as a mainstay of daytime television. Following the release of her initial statement in the wake of his passing, DeGeneres later released a touching video about the greatest ways to remember him. 
The family, friends, and loved ones of Stephen Twitch Boss continue to be in our thoughts at Cinema Blend. His mother's story demonstrates that, during what must be an extremely trying period, his loved ones are still grieving his loss. This is a paraphrased version of People.com's report. Stephen Twitch Boss, a former DJ for the Ellen DeGeneres show and a member of CITIC, died at age 40. In a statement made exclusively to People, Stephen Twitch Boss wife Allison Holker Boss acknowledged his passing, saying, He was the backbone of our family, the best husband and father, and an inspiration to his admirers. At the age of 40, Stephen Twitch Boss committed suicide. In an exclusive statement to People, Boss wife Allison Holker Boss, 34, says, It is with the heaviest of hearts that I have to disclose my husband Stephen has departed us. Stephen brought light into every space he entered. Above all else, he treasured his family, friends, and community. He believed that the best way to lead was to lead with love and light. He served as the foundation of our family, was the best husband and father, and served as an example to his followers. It would be an understatement to say that he left a legacy, and his beneficial influence will still be felt, she added. There won't be a day that goes by that we don't remember him, I'm positive of that. During this trying moment for myself and especially for our three kids, we kindly request your privacy. Allison concluded by leaving her spouse with a message. She ended by saying, Stephen, we love you, we miss you, and I will always save the last dance for you. Boss debuted as a guest DJ on the Ellen DeGeneres show in 2014. He eventually established himself as a regular character on the show, and in 2020, he was promoted to co-executive producer. In the past, Allison and the late celebrity co-hosted Disney's fairy tale weddings. Additionally, he made appearances in a number of well-known movies and TV shows, such as Step Up All In, Modern Family, and Magic Mike XXL. Off-screen, Boss shared entertaining dance videos on social media with his wife Allison, who also took part in Siddict. In their dance video clips, their kids would frequently join the couple. Boss leaves behind his wife Allison and three children, Wesley, 14, Maddox, 6, and Zaya, 3. And that is all we have for today, folks. Make sure to hit that subscribe button to get updates, new exclusive interviews, and more special report. Ellen DeGeneres cries while discussing Twitch. Send love to one another. As she continues to grieve the loss of her close friend Stephen Twitch Boss, Ellen DeGeneres pays tribute to him by urging others to love one another. The 11 days since Twitch passed have been difficult and sad, Ellen said in her tear-jerking update on Friday morning. She also mentioned how difficult the holidays may be for certain people. She urges her followers to carry on laughing and having a good time with one another in memory of the late dancer because that is what he loved to do. Millions of Twitch users must have related to this clip because Ellen closes by urging everyone to spread love to one another. As we previously reported, the day TMZ revealed the news of his passing, Ellen paid tribute to her close friend by stating, I'm devastated. Twitch was only pure light and love. I had nothing but love to give him because he was my family. He will be missed. Please offer Allison and his three lovely children, Wesley, Maddox, and Zaya, your love and support. Since his passing, Twitch has had an abundance of love. His mother, Connie, told him, Your mother loves you to eternity and beyond. And that is our special report for the day. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell to get notifications when we upload new content to our channel. You can look forward to weekly interviews, raw and uncut stories, industry news, and more.